Rules of divisibility. Five. In the next thirty seconds, we will see if you can tell at a glance if a number is divisible by five. Check out these numbers. Think, don't say. Which is divisible by five? Three hundred and twenty-five. Five thousand seven hundred and eighty-eight. Seventy-one thousand three hundred and twenty. If you think these numbers are divisible by five, you're right. Here's how to spot the pattern. Look at the five times table. Every multiple of five ends in a five or a zero. Any number that ends in five or zero can be evenly divided by five. So five is a factor. And of course, it doesn't matter how big or small the numbers are. If it ends in five or zero, then five is a factor. Let's see if you can tell at a glance if any number in this next group has five as a factor. Hold up your yes or no answer to show your teacher what you think. Your teacher will pause the film to give you time to answer. Is five a factor of one hundred and thirty-two, eight thousand five hundred and eighty-five, twenty-two thousand nine hundred and twenty-eight, a hundred and fifty-six thousand and thirty-five? Six million five hundred thousand. If you said no, yes, no, yes, and yes, then you've got it. Now it's time for you to practice. There are two parts to the work. First, look at the numbers on the worksheet your teacher gives you, and quickly put a check mark beside each number that has five as a factor. Hands up to show your teacher when you have finished this step. When your teacher has checked your at-a-glance work, go ahead and divide by five.